as the British royal family navigates a challenging period marked by health issues, fans were shocked to learn that the Prince and Princess of Wales issued a rare joint message expressing their incredible sadness on social media. This message came in response to the tragic death of an RAF pilot at RAF Koningsby on Saturday. The crash occurred during a Battle of Britain event, and the royal couple expressed their condolences and solidarity with the pilot's loved ones and the RAF community. Posting on X, formerly known as Twitter, the Waleses wrote, Incredibly sad to hear the news this afternoon from RAF Koningsby. Our thoughts this evening are with the pilot's loved ones, the Battle of Britain Memorial Flight, and the wider RAF family. They signed off with WNC, confirming the message was directly from them. The incident involved a famous aircraft that plummeted to the ground just before 1.20 p.m., coming to rest near a building at RAF Koningsby in Lincolnshire. Pictures from the scene showed a stricken plane near a single-story building, and a rescue helicopter was dispatched to the site. Prince William was the honorary air commodore of RAF Koningsby from 2008 until August 2023, when he handed over the role to Princess Catherine. Lincolnshire police confirmed the tragedy in a statement, noting that the injuries sustained by the pilot were not survivable. William and Catherine's last personal message before this was in April, when they paid tribute to victims of a tragic stabbing attack in Sydney. The horrific event at the Westfield Shopping Centre in Bondi Junction resulted in six fatalities, 12 injuries and surgery for a nine-month-old baby. The Prince and Princess of Wales expressed their condolences and solidarity with those affected by the tragedy, demonstrating their commitment to addressing significant events both in the UK and internationally. Recently, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis have been off school enjoying the May half-term break. William had to cancel a scheduled royal visit at the last minute, with Kensington Palace issuing a statement expressing regret and looking forward to rescheduling. Despite this, William and Prince George found time to enjoy the FA Cup final. As president of the Football Association, William had the honor of awarding the trophy to the winning team. Photos showed William and George watching the match intently, with many fans noting the striking similarities between their mannerisms and outfits. William wore a dark blue suit with a white shirt and a red, white, and blue striped tie, while George matched his father with a dark suit and a blue and white striped tie. In a sweet moment, Prince George maintained his composure despite his excitement when Jack Grealish shook his hand after the game. The young royal grinned and looked up at his dad showcasing his growing confidence. George also exchanged a few words with Manchester City manager Pep Guardiola and former Manchester United manager Sir Alex Ferguson, further highlighting his poise and charm. The FA Cup final outing came after the royal family had to cancel some planned events. Prince William has been seen at several games for his favourite soccer team, Aston Villa, recently. Aston Villa's successful season, which ended with them qualifying for the UEFA Champions League for the first time, brought joy to William. He even tweeted a congratulatory message to the team. A close source mentioned that soccer has been an important comfort for William during these challenging times. On April 11, William took Prince George to an Aston Villa game. When asked if George was now part of the pride, a term used by Villa fans to describe their supporters, William confirmed that his son was indeed loving it. This father-son bonding over soccer has provided a welcome distraction and a source of joy for William and George, highlighting the importance of family and shared passions during difficult periods.